What's good with the YouTube? I'm giving y'all a brief update on the NBA Youngboy case. And right before I get into that, I'm going to need for every single one of y'all to like and subscribe. And I appreciate every single one of y'all who like and subscribe. So now that we get into the video, the judges really didn't have enough information to lock him up or nothing. So they pushed the court date back to March 22nd or the 23rd. And that's the days when they finally decide. By then, it would be for sure, for sure that we would have an answer on if he's free or not. But right now, we don't we don't get the verdict right now. But the, proxy, the prosecution team lacked evidence and failed to give a valid reason on how the evidence they took was legal. So this case is in young boy's favor. So he might be a free man. Well, he is a free man. I'm gonna speak that into existence. You know, I don't wish jail on nobody or house arrest on nobody. I know he didn't been in there for a long time. Y'all see he on the stop the violence stuff. I hope he keep that up when he get off a of house arrest. Otherwise, I'm just not gonna see him as a man of his words. But honestly, I think he'll he'll be good. He'll do good. I feel like. I feel like he shouldn't really pay too much attention to all of his quote unquote ops on the internet and he should just keep running that money up for him and his kids. Because I feel like if he keep doing this stop the violence and he rap about more positive stuff, then eventually his life start being a little more better because we see like YB, he been in, in pretty tough situations for pretty much his whole career and honestly it'll be so much satisfaction seeing him grow as a person out of that shell that he was in and get out of his head about old stuff it's time for him to move on and do better but anyways i thank anybody watching this and like i said like and subscribe for more videos and updates peace out